We invite you to subscribe to Mystic Post TV on YouTube, thank you. But I am afraid that just as Eve was deceived by the serpent's cunning, your minds may somehow be led astray from your sincere and pure devotion to Christ. For if someone comes to you and preaches a Jesus other than the Jesus we preached, or if you receive a different spirit from the spirit you received, or a different gospel from the one you accepted, you put up with it easily enough. Corinthians 2, chapter 11 verses 3 and 4. The gospel passage clearly alerts us to the dangers of a different spirit which if not from Jesus, the spirit is that of the Antichrist. Archbishop Jose Gomez, leader of the Archdiocese of Los Angeles, recently stepped forward, in a major speech, to warn the Catholic faithful of the different spirits now overtaking our culture. He said, new ideologies forming out of progressive, cancel culture, woke thinking and nothing less than a new religion constructed to challenge and destroy traditional Christian faith. The space that the church and believing Christians are permitted to occupy is shrinking thanks to wokeism, the Archbishop said. Church institutions and Christian-owned businesses are increasingly challenged and harassed. The same is true for Christians working in education, healthcare, government, and other sectors. Holding certain Christian beliefs is said to be a threat to the freedoms, and even to the safety, of other groups in our societies. This new woke religion, this different spirit Gomez says, rejects the salvation of Christ for the salvation found in racial and class struggle. Constant struggle against oppression is the woke path to salvation. Woke faith is incompatible with Christian faith for very simple reasons. It is atheistic and denies God and Christ. It replaces the sin and salvation path with one of its own, which offers only constant warfare. In denying God, these new movements have lost the truth about the human person, Gomez said. This explains their extremism, and their harsh, uncompromising, and unforgiving approach to politics. Archbishop Gomez warns the church to see these new ideologies as a new religion and forcefully reject it. We should not be intimidated by these new religions of social justice and political identity, Gomez says. The gospel remains the most powerful force for social change that the world has ever seen. In a message dated March 25, 2015, Our Lady at Medjugorje warned the world of these new ideologies as well and says that Satan is behind these new religions. She says we can see the hand of Satan in what she calls the culture of modernism. She said, Dear children, also today the Most High permits me to be with you and to lead you on the way of conversion. Many hearts have shut themselves to grace and have become deaf to my call. You, little children, pray and fight against temptation and all the evil plans which the devil offers you through modernism. Be strong in prayer and with the cross in your hands pray that evil may not use you and may not conquer in you. I am with you and pray for you. Thank you for having responded to my call. Our Lady is calling. God bless and thank you for watching Mystic Post TV.